and welcome to Guide Star Global. Uh, my name is John Howell and I'm the Editorial Director. With me today is Noelia Luque. Noelia is an advisor at Manzanares International Lawyers based here in Marbella on the Costa del Sol in Spain. Noelia, welcome. Thank you. Now you are uh, the author of several of our guides to doing business in mm -hmm. the Costa del Sol and you've been advising foreign clients for what about 12 years? 12 years, yes. So mm -hmm. you must have got a few horror stories. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, this video is a very short video about um, opening a bar or running a bar mm -hmm. and of course we have got a full guide about that uh, that mm -hmm. in written form. Thousands of people seem to have the dream of running a bar in Spain. <laughs> Hundreds of them try it and most fail. Mm -hmm. What is it causes a bar to fail in Spain? Um, the problem is that uh, I think uh, from my point of view of our, uh, my experience with the clients that uh, had this, this problem um, is uh, the first thing you need to realize that you're in Spain. In Spain you're going to pay tax, uh, you have to pay many duties, uh, you, you need to comply with uh, um, many uh, formalities uh, from, uh, from the legal point of view. And, uh, for example, if you employ, you have employees, which is a normal thing if you open a bar, because uh, otherwise you, you have to spend uh, all your time, all your life. 23 in, in, hours a day. Exactly, in the, in, 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 in the business. And um, uh, employing people is expensive. Uh, because, because you have uh, to pay social you security. Pay, uh, social security yeah. and uh, you have to comply and, with and health and safety. And how much is social security here in Spain? Uh, you, you have to add 40% uh, yes, to the salary 40% that of the you salary, pay so, uh, to, to the employee. Uh, so, that's way higher than most people mm -hmm. are used to in most countries. So, exactly. Yes. So all these things, uh, some of our clients uh, maybe do not take the, the time of uh, planning, of uh, really thinking about it and uh, sit down and really uh, make some calculations. They on, don't get their finances right. They exactly. don't, they, they don't mm -hmm. plan and work out mm -hmm. exactly you know, how much money they have to take in order to pay all of these expenses. Mm -hmm. And also, um, sometimes uh, the business is going to start working very quickly. Uh, here in the Costa del Sol, for example, uh, in the summer, uh, there are many places and uh, a lot of uh, tourists and people for holiday. Uh, so it could work, work way, uh, well, but uh, you have a whole year to fill in with clients. Sure. Your business and it's much quieter in October and November and yes. December. Uh -huh. Yes, it's completely different. The market yes. changes. It's the whole, local. The people. feel of the place is different. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. um, so those are two very good tips. What about the the amount of work you have to do if you're running mm -hmm. a bar? Do you have any experience of that? Um, I know by our clients. Uh, I know that uh, it's long hours and yeah. it's hard work. Because here, so, okay. bars will stay open until 1 o'clock in the morning, 2 oh, o'clock no. in the morning. Oh, no. yes. um, mm -hmm. So then you have to clean up. Mm -hmm. And then the following day, you probably have to go to the market to buy your food. Mm -hmm. And so you're probably working from 8 or 9 o'clock in the morning through till 2 or 3 o'clock exactly. the following morning. So you need help for all that. Yes. And uh, at the beginning, uh, it's normal that uh, you, you're not uh, having a high income. So uh, you cannot maybe have uh, all the stuff that uh, you may need. So... It's, it's a bit yeah. tough. Uh, the beginnings are always... And of course, the good news behind all of this is that there are some bars that are fantastically successful yes. and where people make a lot of money. Of course. So And the whole year. If just you're the going summer. to mm -hmm. open the bar, let's make you one of the successful ones by mm -hmm. doing a bit of preparation. Yes, exactly. Yes. That's, that's no, Elliot, thank you very much. Thank you. Hope you found that useful. Uh, if you've liked it, please like us on uh, YouTube and follow the channel. If you uh, would like to contact Noelia, you can do so via the link that's in the information box. Uh, and uh, we look forward to seeing you again. Thank you and goodbye.